at the bottom of my receipt, there's all this recall stuff. It literally says recall notice and it's saying like all these Hey y'all, welcome back or welcome to my channel. Thank you for coming to check out this video today. I am about to head into Fred Meyer. Um, I'm going in here to get a few items, not a bunch of stuff. My kids have been asking me to do a movie night for a couple days now. Um, Kung Fu Panda 4 came out on Monday, I think it was. And I've been telling them that we could do a movie night. And so I'm finally coming to the store to get everything that we need to make this little movie night possible for them as far as all the snacks and all that stuff goes. I'm pretty much just coming in here today to get the items that I need to make the pizzas. So if you've seen my videos lately, about a couple videos back, I came into Fred Meyer and um, I found some Nan pizza crust in the clearance section. So I decided that we're gonna make some pizzas tonight. And then I have a few other snacks that I wanna get. I wanna try to find some popcorn, like. I want to try to find the popcorn that you put on the stove to pop and I've seen it before I've actually gotten it before and I'm pretty sure that I got it at Winco but I want to see if they have it here in Fred Myers as well we do not own a microwave so there's no putting popcorn in the microwave and letting it pop and they kind of like watching it pop on the stove anyway so I want to go in here and see if I can find the popcorn I want to get all the ingredients that I need to make um, the pizzas um, as far as like the toppings and then I don't need any other snacks. I already have other snacks that I plan to put together for the movie night, for the little snack tray and everything. I'm thinking about making my own pizza sauce, but I'm not quite sure. I'm gonna go in here and see what the pizza so what the sauces are looking like, see how much they are as far as price goes. I'm pretty sure that I have all the ingredients that I have at home to make my own pizza sauce though. I've never made it before, but I'm pretty sure I can find a good recipe um online as to how to make it and i'm pretty sure it's not that it's not that hard anyway it's pretty much simple ingredients tomatoes stuff like that so y'all i'm about to head in here to get everything that i need to make this movie night possible for my kids that they have been asking me for all week they're very excited so i'm gonna go in here and i'm gonna get everything that we need all right guys let's go They have the grapes on sale for $1.49 a pound, but they are only the weekly digital deal. I always have issues when I'm using the digital coupons. So I should get some and see if I can figure out the coupon today. But you know what? I don't have time to figure out the coupon today. I'll come back and get grapes. That's really not on um, my list of things to get out of here today. I actually came in here a few days ago and found some pizza nan bread so i'm gonna be using that tonight for the pizzas so really all i need is the toppings one of the things that i want to get is some mushrooms i don't see anything over here though let me see i gotta find the mushrooms their jalapeno peppers are $1.59 a piece these don't look too great i probably only need two the jalapenos will probably just go on my pizza. I don't think the kids are gonna eat it, but I'll grab the two jalapenos and put it on probably like half the pizza. I'm not sure how I'm gonna do the pizzas yet, but I do know I want one of them to be like a veggie pizza, and then I might just do a cheese pizza. I'm not gonna do pepperonis today. So I got a couple jalapenos so far. I'm gonna grab some mushrooms. I already have, um, green peppers and all that at home so I don't need any of that let's see so I think I have everything that I need um, at home to make the pizza sauce I was gonna get um, the jar of pizza sauce but I thought about it and I was like you know what I can just make my own it's not too hard to make it it's simple ingredients they have these rice cakes in here. These are pizza flavored rice cakes. These are $1.95. They have the mini chocolate ones, but I don't see any more of those. Those were only 70 cents. I'm not surprised those are gone already. 
They have these farmhouse cheddar ones for $1.99. And these are sour cream and chive ones, $2.37. These are tangy barbecue. These ones are gone too. These ones were $1.12. I think these ones right here. I think these ones are regular price $3.19. They're regular price $2.49. I wonder if my kids would like these pizza ones right here. Uh, I don't know. $1.95, that's not a bad price for those. I really wish the chocolate ones were there though for 70 cents. But of course those are all gone trying to see if I can see any up there. Nope, those are all gone. These grapefruit roll-ups right here for 29 cents. I'm gonna get a couple of these, that's not bad. That's not a bad deal for those. 29 cents for those ones. They have the cherry ones that are 29 cents as well. I'm gonna get a couple of the cherry ones. The raspberry ones are 56 cents. That's not much of a deal from the 59 cents. But the grape, and the cherry are only 29 cents, so I grabbed a few of those. Now we don't have a microwave, so I cannot get the microwavable popcorn. And I don't see the popcorn that they have that you can just put on the stove in here. And I don't really want to get a bag of popcorn. They have these ones down here, the kernels. And someone was telling me that you can just put them in a pot and put the aluminum foil over it and pop it like that. But I really rather just have the one that you sit on the stove, but they do not have it in here. I thought they would have that in here, but they don't. So I don't need any chips or anything like that. I have some chips at home already. So the other thing that I need to get is some olives. Okay, over here at the olives. Let's see, these ones right here are on sale for $1.49. It says buy five or more and it's 99 cents. Well, I don't need five, I just need two of them. So, we got two cans of olives. Now I need to find some cheese and then I wanna do some pineapples just to throw on maybe half of the pizza for the kids to try it. They've never had um, like pineapple pizza, any pineapples on their pizza before. So I'm gonna get them just so they can try it. I don't know how it's gonna taste. I don't know if they're gonna like it. It's not like Canadian bacon and pineapple. I'm not gonna get any pepperoni or anything today. I wanna do strictly um, meatless. So we're gonna do meatless. Yeah, I came by the clearance aisle. I'm not shopping on the clearance section today, but I do wanna just look over here real quick. They have these little puff strawberry beet snacks. These are little kid snacks right here. They got a few of them. They got the sweet potato, apple asteroids, $2.13. And then that's it. I think these are all the same. Yeah, they are. So this is a quick glimpse of that. I don't see much over there. So I'm just gonna keep it moving. And plus I didn't come in here to shop the clearance aisle today, guys. I came in here to get my movie night snacks. So I wanna say I have, I'm actually hoping that I have all the sauce um, that I need to make my own pizza sauce. I'm just using tomato paste, tomato sauce, and then some seasonings. And I'm pretty sure I have everything that I need. I'm hoping that I do, because if I don't, I will be right back at the store. But they do have them over here. But I feel like I have them at home and I can pretty much just make it from home. But the crust that I'm gonna be using is similar to this but it is the stone fired nan bread crust um i've never used that one before but i have used the nan i have had the nan bread but i've never used the crust before so i'm curious to how it's gonna taste but i feel like it should come out fine i'm really sitting here contemplating getting some pizza sauce but honestly guys with all the stuff that's in this i feel like i can just make my own and come out a little bit cheaper because these ones these ones are two for three this one's $5.99, but I feel like I have all the ingredients at home. So I'm just gonna make my pizza sauce from scratch at home, guys. So the last thing I need is some cheese and I wanna get some mozzarella cheese. I don't know if I want it out of the package or if I wanna shred my own cheese. These ones are buy one, get one free and they are $3.99 a piece. But you know what, I think I might just go over. I don't see any right here. I'm gonna go look in the other aisle. Maybe I'll just shred my own cheese. 
So they have all these pepperonis right here, but I tell myself that I really didn't want to do pepperoni um, on the pizzas. Um, they do have these pork and beef uncured pepperoni. This is regular pepperoni. They've got some turkey pepperoni. These are only $2.79 for the Kroger brand. They have these meal prep containers, same kind of containers, the same brand of containers that I got in here for 80 cents or 88 cents. I forget how much they were, but they were really cheap that day. These ones are just meal prep containers with the um, departments, but those are $6.90. They were originally $11.99 and there's a 10 pack in there. Look at these holiday almonds, y'all. They have some snickerdoodle flavored, frosted brownie, peppermint cocoa. These are just the regular ones. These are smokehouse and these ones are wasabi. But these new holiday ones, would you guys try these? So I could not find the mozzarella cheese um, in the blocks like this. I wanted to shred my own. So I'm just gonna come back over here and grab these ones. These are $3.99 and they are buy one, get one free. You know what, I think I'm just gonna get one mozzarella and then one of the triple cheddar cheese and this should be enough. I really wanted to shred my own cheese, guys. I wanted to shred my own mozzarella, but I don't see it. All right, y'all, so I got my cheese, my mozzarella cheese, and then I also got this triple cheddar cheese. I got some pineapples, some mushrooms, some jalapenos. I got some olives, and then I grabbed these just because they were on sale. I'm about to head to the register, guys and i will make my own pizza sauce i already got the pizza crust and everything and then i'll probably go to winco to try to see if i can find um the popcorn okay. if you have coupons press coupon otherwise so my total is twelve dollars and 73 cents all right y'all so i am back in the car and I was looking over my receipt and it is super crazy because at the bottom of my receipt, there's all this recall stuff. It literally says recall notice and it's saying like all these purchases that are all these items that you may have purchased that are listed below saying that if you purchase these items, contact this person and that person. I'm not going to say the name of it, but it says the product may be contaminated with listeria and if eating could result in severe illness to those individuals who may consume this product. That's crazy. A lot of them are like the Kroger little salad bowls. You guys know if you've been watching my channel that I purchase these little Santa Fe salads and all that all the time. And these are literally on here. It's like, there's like 10 different salads on here that it's saying um, were contaminated. Uh, it says with the dates of 920 through 103 pretty sure I purchased a salad within that time. So really times are getting crazy because everything that you eat nowadays is either containing some kind of listeria, some kind of E. coli, some kind of something. And this is getting super, super crazy to where it's like, what are we supposed to be eating? Because every time you turn around, something is contaminated with something. I went in there and I spent though um, $12.68 I'm hoping that nothing I bought was contaminated because that's just crazy. Anyways, y'all, that is the end of the video. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. Be safe out there. Pay attention to what you're eating. But honestly, I can't even say pay attention to what you're eating because we don't know until after we've eaten something that it's contaminated or it had this in it or that in it. So it's kind of hard to even eat anything. You can't even eat a freaking salad now salads are supposed to be good for you what kind of what kind of mess is that <sighs> make sure you like comment share and subscribe and i will see you guys all in the next video all right bye <laughs>